Hello everyone and welcome to the Stake Hall Weekly News. The most attractive zones for IBC transfer Osmosis Juno, Cosmos, Stargaze and Terra. The total number of IBC transfer in 70 was over 2 million dollars. And now let's move on to CoinGecko. General positive dynamics of tokens in the Cosmos network, also Osmosis, Terra, Juna and Atom were on the top of the most popular tokens among all ecosystem, which is a very good indicator. Here is a big growth in the Encro protocol token ENC, 55% plus, and Ouroboros blockchain token Aura, 50% plus. Juna and Osmo are also attracting attention with 27% plus and 11%. The price of their token is already $42 and $10. The space ecosystem is actively recovering with recent drawdowns like falling of the main token of the Atom network to $24. Sifchain announced a pioneer release which will include a few very important items. Increasing the staking APR to 300%, IBC Go library patch to assist in the handling of unknown client states. The proposal includes an increase in staking APR to be competitive with what is being provided for current liquidity mining rewards. This is important because it balances liquidity rewards with the health of the protocol. As the staking APR increases, more Rowan will be going into circulation each day. They are expecting that this temporary change will lead to more tokens being bounded, which both increases chain security and removes the amount of tokens available to sell as people seek to compound their gains. On February 28th, the Asmosis blockchain has done one of the most important upgrades in its history, the version 7 upgrade. Dubbed Carbon by development team, version 7 packed with several long-awaited features, including the highly anticipated Superfluid Staking model. Superfluid Staking has finally arrived and implemented into the Osmosis Planet. It allows you to stake your 14-day bounded LLP shares with a validator and earn portion of the Osmosis Staking APR in addition to the APR you already get from bounding your LP shares in a liquidity pool. In addition, Superfluid Staking comes with a built-in Superfluid Discount Factor parameter, which reduces the percentage of allowable LP shares that can be staked using Superfluid Staking by a preset amount. This parameter can be changed through governance, but at launch the discount parameter will be set to 15%. The Carbon Upgrade brings with it the initial Cosmos integration into the Osmosis blockchain. This Cosmos integration is the first step to allowing for permission smart contracting capability on Osmosis, which will enable dApps and additional functionality to be built directly on the top of the Osmosis blockchain. These smart contracts will be permissioned, meaning that any application or vision to build on Osmosis will need to seek approval to do so via Osmosis governance first. The third feature is IAVL. It plays a role in transmitting data from a node's hard drive to its RAM. Its update allows for more RAM to be utilized on a node, which drastically increases its processing speed. As a result, EPO block times significantly decreased. And there are some more features that you can find in a Smosis block. Architecture now splits into query nodes and validator nodes. Query nodes contains optimization that may not be entirely safe for validators and greatly improve querying performance. In addition, contracts are now served by two different enclaves, query enclaves and execute enclaves. This will allow updating query enclave and improving performance without consensus breaking changes. Lastly, RockDB support is enabled. They are releasing binaries for each supported database. RocksDB is recommended for performance, but requires a resynchronization of any nodes currently running Go-level DB. Persistence has released an update from older version to the new one. Since the previous release contains a bug in app, wiring which throws an error when user tries to update IBC client. At the moment, the bug has been fixed and all validators have been updated to the appropriate version. 
Secret Network introduced Secret and Moist Payments. It's a secure and private system on a secret network for requesting and sending money to business counterparties. Secret Invoices is the first privacy-preserving payment request secret contracts that has ever been created, empowering users on Secret Network to leverage the power of secret contracts for their everyday transactions. With a cross-chain smart contract calls, Secret Invoices could go inter-chain, empowering business and users on public chains to trigger private invoice settlement transactions on Secret Network. Bitson announced Symfonia, the new name of the best song fan talking app. Symfonia will allow various artists on their label companies to create their own fan tokens. Each having a diverse scope and ability of customization depending on their particular needs. Users can hold, trade, or redeem their fan tokens for VIP rewards. The Symfonia app interface will offer access to four different features of the platform. These are Assets, Swap, Dex, and Pools. Symfonia will be ready for launch within the coming weeks. And here is some of the benefits. Get VIP access to exclusive gigs and events. Vote on matters like upcoming tour location or stage outfits. Purchase unique NFTs of album art or songs only available to fan token holders. A promising Hermes chain was launched this week and we became its validators. We've collected information that will help you understand what an Hermes is and why is it worth choosing it. Hermes is a decentralized proof of stake blockchain in the Cosmos ecosystem. It is Ethereum virtual machine, EVM based, meaning it is fully compatible with the Ethereum network. Imus's goal is to bring the world to the interoperable networks of the Cosmos ecosystem and to innovate in the space of EVM and interchain compatibility. Imus offers the fast finality and high throughput of Cosmos-based blockchains. By using Ethereum's EVM, developers can deploy their Ethereum-based applications in the Tendermint consensus environment with lower transaction fees faster transaction speed, and security provided by proof-of-stake consensus. Imus has also enabled Cosmos Inter-Blockchain Communication Protocol IBC, that allows for the direct sharing of tokens and data among the Tendermint-based chains that use it. Users from all 28 IBC-enabled independent blockchains will be able to assess the utilities seen on Ethereum, including decentralized exchanges, marketplaces, lending protocols, NFT applications, gaming, and more, as developers deploy their major application logic from Ethereum directly on EMUS. EMUS, the native token of EMUS, is used for paying transaction fees, staking to secure the network, and for taking part in EVMAS governance to determine the decisions for changing core protocol parameters, the distribution of the community treasury, and more. Any EVMAS holders can submit or vote on a proposal to use funds from the EVMAS community pool using the protocol's governance model. The EVMAS token release schedule will have an initial supply of 200 million tokens at Genesis, divided between rag drop participants and community pool and the strategic reserve. Newly released tokens will be distributed across blocks as follows. Second rewards 40%, APR 38.5%, team allocation 25%, usage incentives 25%, shared pool 10%. Validators and delegators are critical to the security of the EVMAS blockchain and help with blocks proposal and validation. 40% of newly issued tokens will be used to reward active validators and their delegators in proportion of the number of staked EVMAS tokens. Stargaze is an NFT marketplace based on Cosmos. They are introducing a new fee structure, Fairburn. 50% is burned, making stars and deflationary assets. 50% sent to stakers and delegators and 0% goes to the team. All fees and percentages can be changed by governance vote. Now you can see a weekly APR update. 
Stargaze is now connected to 10 other chains over IBC, such as Space, Osmosis, Juno, Secret, etc. Stargaze is currently launching a large number of NFT projects that are already popular among NFT lovers. Thank you for your attention.